Hey guys, about two weeks ago I got an email from Elegu asking if I wanted to do a review on their Uno starter kit. I said, sure, send me one. They did, it's here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna pop this guy open and check it out. I've got a real soft spot for the Arduino Uno. I got a bunch of them in my R2D2 controlling a lot of the LEDs and several motors and a lot of the other animatronics inside my droid. So let's see how good this starter kit is. You ready? Let's do this. Hey guys, welcome back. So first of all, welcome to my channel where nerdy is cool. My name is Paul. This is my fun channel where we cover all my fun projects, R2 building, BB-8, Oodles of 3D printers, you get the idea. So welcome. If you're not a subscriber already, please click the button down in the corner so you can become one. I don't want you to miss any of my cool content. If you haven't seen my videos before, be sure to check my playlist. I have all kinds of stuff on Octoprint, 3D printing, R2 building, you name it. If you're already a subscriber, welcome back. So that said, with any luck, I got both cameras going here. Got the package, got the scissors ready to go. Let's pop this guy open and see what we got. And if we are lucky, the cats will be quiet and not cause havoc in the background. All right. It's packed quite well. All right. Well, they do have the packing down pack. All right. This is very impressive because my last kits that I received were basically a cardboard box and they just threw the components in there. Um, I, I bought them in the past from SparkFun and from uh, Adafruit, but uh, this looks like, uh, this is pretty interesting. Let's pop this guy open and see what we have. Oh, look at that, we even have documentation. PDF, code, libraries. Well, this is this is very promising. I like that. And inside, they talk about all the items that are in here. So I get the other camera going. So hopefully that will show some of that up. And a nice little thank you. And they include where to contact uh, support and uh, service, and then where to find them on Facebook. So that's cool. Wow. Let's look at all this stuff. Well, as we would expect, we have the uh, we have the Uno in here. Uh, I'm seeing a few things that I have not seen in other kits uh, right off the bat. Uh, <laughs> something as simple as the battery. <laughs> uh, that's, that's handy. Um, the uh, breakout board, the breadboard rather. Other kits I've seen where they do have the, uh, the LEDs and a couple of, uh, looks like we got a bunch of uh, capacitors and buttons and such. So this is interesting. I mean, this kit, what does this kit cost? I think 35 bucks. This is a nice, uh, this is a nice value. And we have some, uh, looks like a ultrasonic sensor here. And we've got motors. I'm not sure what that breakout board does, but I'm sure we'll find out in the future. We have a uh, micro uh, servo, which is gonna be good. This is interesting right here. So this is, looks like a breakout board of some type here for the USB power and some other stuff. We'll have to do some research as the projects pile up here. Uh, a couple of things that I'm spotting right off is I do like this. I mean, first of all, there's a ton of accessories in this thing. Uh, I do like the display. That's cool. And we got here, we got a, uh, a big power converter. <laughs> Reminds me of Star Wars. But Dad, I wanted to go in town and get power converters. Yeah, I don't even know what some of these things are. That's, <laughs> that, I'm a little speechless here. Look at all the cool toys in this thing. Okay, and we're all gonna recognize the blue USB cord because we got gazillions of these things from all the 3D printers we bought. All right, this is a uh, step motor. You can see that with the uh, cable here. All right, and we have a pretty slick way of uh, going from nine volt to jack here for the, uh, for the Uno. Well, this looks like we have a little, uh, looks like one of the exercises inside is gonna be a fan, so we can do that. 
And these things, oh my God, I can't say enough good things about these jump leads, especially when you're starting to first learn and you're uh, wiring things from the Uno to the breadboard. I mean, this is just, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, this looks uh, it's a nice, that's an LCD screen. I don't know how many characters that is, but um, certainly reminds me of uh, some of the earlier ones I messed with. Hey, we got a remote control, so if we want to get into some of these more advanced projects, that's going to be kind of neat. So that must mean, if that's a remote control, we must have an IR sensor somewhere here in this stack of stuff. Uh, let's see, it looks like we have a knob, almost like a controller. And I'm willing to bet maybe that's what this goes on to. Yeah, that's exactly what that goes on to. Sweet. Uh, <laughs> okay, so... Um, as I'm saying, I, I, nothing is staged here. I am literally just learning what's in here by opening it up in real time with you guys. And, uh, oh wow, so this is the real McCoy. This is a full-size breadboard. I just thought we were only gonna get that small little one uh, for projects, but no, this is, the, this is the big guy. Seen a lot of the kits I bought in the past didn't include this. And, uh, you know, unfortunately, like most places, you know, you don't have a Radio Shack to go to anymore. You can't go locally to buy this stuff. And, Sometimes when you buy these kits online, you just kind of assume they're gonna have everything you need. And what's happened to me in the past is I'd be working on a project or I'd be doing a tutorial on learning Arduino Uno. Uh, I've always, I've had a lot of fun learning how to use motors and, uh, and stepper motors and uh, various sensors. And um, it never failed, you know, I would look through my kit and I was missing one of the components I would need. So, uh, and the breadboard was one of those things I needed. So this is cool, this is the full size one. I'm impressed. And then we have basically a big ribbon cable with the ends are already on it. And oh wow, look at that, we got resistors. We got 2K, 100K. That's impressive. You get all this stuff for 35 bucks. Wow. <laughs> this is really cool, guys. So the other thing I wanna do, let me start this put some of this stuff a little bit away here. Um, the fact that it's all carried, you know, you can stuff it all into a container, um, that's really slick. This is the, uh, on the other side here, we get the whole super starter kit, and they basically, uh, I'll try to hold it up to the camera here, it gives you a full inventory of what you have in here. So, you know, it's not like, I bought a starter kit from, I can't remember which vendor, and I don't want to, <laughs> you know, it hurt anyone's feelings here. But I remember uh, you would go digging around because you knew in this cardboard box that, yo, somewhere in here is this part or piece. Um, what this does right here is this tells you exactly what each piece does. Uh, and as I'm looking through here, I'm learning that a few of the pieces that I picked up that I had no idea. This, for example, is a five volt one piece relay. Okay. And is also uh, <laughs> kind of a rock today because it's been a really hot, muggy summer day. Uh, this is a humidity sensor. so. Uh, might be something I would be interested in playing with sooner than later. Really curious about this. This must be, let me look at this again. Looking at the, con the connector, that must be the stepper motor. Yep, yeah, so there it is. So what can I say? I mean, for 35 bucks, this is a great value. If you have uh, kids uh, that are interested in science, technology, engineering, and math kind of stuff, STEM, uh, this would definitely be a nice little starter package for them because, like I said, I've bought a bunch of these starter kits in the past and they didn't have nearly as many goodies as this one does. So kind of a short, quick video on the opening of the box and checking it out and being thoroughly impressed by what's inside. What I'm going to do is... Um, I obviously like this. This is really, really cool. Uh, I'm going to post a link in the description below. That's going to be an Amazon affiliate link. So if you decide to buy one of these through that link, that will help me in the channel. Uh, like I said, I, I think we'll, we'll get a couple cents on every link or purchase, but whatever. Uh, if you guys decide to get one, great. If not, that's cool too. But uh, I'm definitely impressed with this uh, starter kit. I'm impressed with the price. And uh, like I said, if you've got uh, kids or if you're an adult and you've always wanted to learn how this technology works and wanted to find a good starter kit, this is it. The other thing too is, uh, like I said, I don't have a CD drive on my laptop, but this has PDFs, so it has instructions and uh, some code and some libraries. So if you want to teach yourself how to use the Arduino Uno and all these various components to work with it and how to code for it, it looks like that stuff is all there too. As always, I welcome your feedback. If you want to reach out to me, you can do so on Facebook, where Nerdy is cool, on Instagram, where Nerdy is cool, on Twitter, where Nerdy cool, 
had to drop a couple characters there to fit in there. And of course, the website is where nerdyiscool.com. As always, I thank you guys for watching. If you wish to support me and my channel, patreon.com forward slash where nerdy is cool is the Patreon way. Or if you prefer to make a small donation via PayPal, in the description below is the PayPal link where you can do so. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And until next time, remember, this is where nerdy is cool. Stay nerdy, guys.